State police say the driver was speeding before the crash. Troopers were following, but not chasing. Then they say the driver ran a red light, causing the deadly collision. Just had a vehicle take off on me. Leo Birmingham Parkway, just passing the barracks now. We're not in pursuit. It's a dark colored SUV. Prosecutors say 19 year old Anderson Nova of Randolph was driving that SUV. They also say he should not have been. His license had been suspended for failure to pay fines and that the motor vehicle was a rental motor vehicle that he was not authorized to operate per the rental agreement. Nova is seen here today in court wearing a bandage from the crash he allegedly caused, which took the life of a 53 year old woman from Maine, Dina Donahue. Prosecutors say Nova ran a red light and slammed into the victim's Honda Civic Monday night near Western Ave and Soldiers Field Road in Brighton. State troopers who had already been following the SUV for speeding quickly came upon the smoky scene. When they got to the, the smoke area, they observed a male uh, fleeing on foot from the dark SUV. That is the defendant before the court, Your Honor, Mr. Nova. Well, I saw the car. Uh, just in that direction and uh, the airbags pop up. Anderson Nova was running and carrying his dog. Sir, he's in custody. Nova is now facing seven criminal charges, including motor vehicle homicide. My client remains deeply apologetic for this accident. State police say they also found credit cards and checks on Nova, but not in his name. So he's also facing a charge for that. The judge set bail today at $100,000 cash in this case and revoked bail for two other pending cases against Nova. Reporting live in Brighton, Todd Kiskevich, WCVB.